Hey friends, I am Heather. I am a part-time reseller on Poshmark, eBay, and Macari, and I'm gonna give you a little thrift haul today. It's been a while since I've posted a video. Um, I've been playing around with some other things and kind of been busy between work and family, so I've been off of YouTube for a little while, but it's time to get back into it. So if a good old-fashioned thrift haul sounds good to you, stick around, let's get going. Okay, so in no particular order, <laughs> I have got piles of things to go through. So I'm going to sort as we go through stuff. Um, that'll help me out too. Okay, so let's see. What do we have here? So this is a new thrift store that's literally right by my work, which is super duper exciting. Um, they also are going to be having tag sales, which is extra special exciting. Um, so they're called AMVETS, which they support the veterans, which is great. Um, so I've been shopping there. Um, there's a lot of, this is, I'm probably going to make this into at least two, maybe three or four videos. Cause I have a lot of stuff to go through real quick. Um, so we're going to make several videos right here. Um, but this, this new store I'm really enjoying. Okay. So this is a Chico size two blazer like a tweed blazer with cute little ruffles on it. And it was a $3.98. I'll like show you the little tags. $3.98 was the price on that. Let's see. We're going to sort as we go. This is very likely a dry clean. It's polyester. It is dry clean only. This will be our dry clean basket. Look at this pretty dress. This is like giving me Jackie O vibes. This is Talbot size six and it was $5.98. It is like a cream beige tweed knee length sheath skirt or she skirt, she dress. Very pretty, very good for the office or for worship services. It also has this cute, almost like little bell at the end of the sleeve right there. And it is like a half sleeve with a back zip super cute. I'm going to assume this is also dry clean. Made in the USA. Let's see what we got. Dry clean only. Okay. I feel like I'm out of practice. Like, I feel like words are not coming to me and I'm just out of practice. 41 Hawthorne size medium. This was $3.48 at the thrift. Very soft, very cozy. Um, it is nylon, wool, alpaca, spandex, and other fiber. And it is hand wash cold. You can wash this with wool in it. Hand wash cold. Okay. So we'll put it right. You know what? I don't know if I want to wash that. I might. I don't know. Line dry, hand wash cold. Maybe we'll hand wash it and then lay it flat. I might wash it by itself. Let's put it in a bag so I kind of have it separated to know to kind of like think about it when I'm washing it. We'll kind of put it right there. Okay, what's next? We got bags everywhere. Sorry. Yeah, you could be a little louder in the laundry room. It fell. <laughs> it fell. All right. This is a Zara Trafaluk, size medium made in Morocco. It is like a green colored blazer with like kind of a little peplum in the back, not so much in the front, but double button. And oh, look at how cute these are. Like I am a sucker for uh, anchor. I love anchor. So how cute are those buttons? Those are adorable. And it's got this green lining on the inside, green striped lining with this little contrast pop of yellow, which is kind of interesting. Where's the tag? for like the store tag. I don't see the store tag. My guess was that this was probably in the 350 range. Um, I don't know where the store tag went. Oh, yay, we have the full tags right here. If you don't know this on Zara pieces, you can take this tag right here. And if you take that series of numbers right there, the M is the size, but if you take that series of numbers and Google it, you can usually find stock photos for Zara. Um, so those are really good numbers to have, um, to, to find stuff for Zara. I was just looking to see what this is made out of. 100% cotton, that's nice. Um, 
So I assume we can wash, we should be able to wash this since it's cotton. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this in the wash. I think we'll wash it in cold though. Let's see. This is BB Dakota size large. And the tags are off of this too. I wonder if my husband, I asked my husband to remove some tags and I wonder if he did some without telling me he did it. Cause I thought he never got to it. But this is a pretty like plaid. This is definitely like academia um, look. And it's not a heavyweight, it's a lightweight blazer. Um, and it is, let's see, I've got a style. I was gonna try to see what it was made out of. It's rayon, poly rayon spandex. And we're gonna hand wash cold. Okay, anytime something tells me to hand wash cold, I wash it cold on delicate in my washing machine. So um, this is a loft, Ann Taylor loft, size 18, but it still has a tag on it. So we can call that new with tags. Ann Taylor loft, great size. And it's like this denim chambray type blazer, one button. And so this, um, because it's got the tag, I will steam it. So let's see, we'll make a pile of steam. We'll just steam that little baby. All right, let's see what else we got. Okay, some shoes. All right, we got a pair of bear traps, like new, hardly any wear on them. They are a smaller size. Um, they, I think they are, where's the tag? Well, there's seven. I mean, that's an okay size. I wear like a 10, so that is a smaller size to me, but that's an okay size. And they were $3.98 at the thrift. We've also got this pair of Keens that are child size, I think three. Yeah, U size three, they need to go through a wash but they're a U size three and they were only charging a dollar 48 for those. Like I was like, what? Yeah, sure. We'll take those. <laughs> yes, please. All right. What else we got? It's like Christmas morning. I have got so much stuff to show you guys. And then I need to get really need to get on it with my photographers. Okay. Talbot size eight, four ninety eight is this blazer. The tweed blazer. Oh, look how pretty these buttons are. Those buttons are really pretty. And let's see, we're probably a dry clean. We are wool, rayon, cotton, nylon, acrylic. And we are turn inside out and dry clean. Okay, so let's just go ahead and turn it inside out. So you guys are helping me sort my laundry. <laughs> turn that baby inside out and dry clean. Definitely, this must have been the day I really like like hit up the blazer section. This is um, Ann Taylor, size uh, six. It was priced at $4.98. Look at this pretty blazer. Look at that, look at that. Like a flower and then the ruffles down the front with that little cute, pretty little raw hem. Such a pretty blazer, very tailored. And let's see what it says. Oh, how, look how pretty this little ruffle is on the inside. Look how feminine, that little ruffle on the inside. It's almost like it wants to be reversible, but it is definitely not reversible. It's got these cute little closure. It's very like a modern. Oh, it does have some pit stains, in, not pit stains, but deodorant stains inside. That's definitely deodorant. So deodorant's hard to get out unless you use hot water. This says dry clean, but it's oh, virgin wool, cotton virgin wool dry clean. Huh, I don't know. We'll see if we can get that out. We will see. All right, look at this beauty. This is Casper size 14. I don't pick Casper up very often, but it was $3.98 and look at how pretty this is. There's the back. I'm just kind of showing you the, I can't think of what that's called either. Um, definitely has a name and I cannot think of it. It's a paisley, but it's like a silk or something. <laughs> if I was a fabric tag, there would I be. It's just poly rayon, but it's definitely like trying to be like a silk. 
and I cannot think of what that's called, but it is a paisley, create like a silvery color with a blue. I don't know if you can see that blue or not. Really pretty. Definitely good for like a worship service or Easter or something like that. Um, how are we going to wash this baby? Uh, this baby, this one likes to be dry cleaned. Dry cleaned. Oh, I just noticed it has the tie, the, where'd it go? Where'd I just see it? There we go. It still has the store tags on it. So we can list that, um, new with tags. I could remove, I'll, I'll use my, um, peeler, Scotty peeler to remove that. So it retail for 119. So we won't dry clean that baby. We will put that over with the steam items and we will steam her. Oh, look how pretty this is. This is vintage. This is a creative silk or creative touch, which is funny because that's the name of my mother-in-law's beauty shop, creative touch. <laughs> it's a hundred percent silk. Um, let's see spot clean made in India. They sold this for $4.98, but look at this beautiful top. This probably had some type of skirt to go with it. Probably like a silk skirt, um, but it's really pretty. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? It has a zipper in the back. There's the back. So I looked this thing over pretty carefully before I bought it. And one thing I noticed, it does have shoulder pads too, but one thing I noticed, and I think this is like a manufacturing flaw. I think there's like some type of different color bead underneath that bead, but I think it's a manufacturing flaw. I don't think that it um, is anything that I can fix. I think it's something in there. and But we'll still keep her and um, spot clean her. So I'm gonna steam her. Um, we'll just put her over here in the steam items, which I've knocked the basket over, so I'm gonna have to step up for just a second and get my basket. Okay, put her in there with the stuff we're gonna steam. Don't mind my big old belly coming through. Okay, that bag is empty. Let's see, what else we got? So this could be a good time for me to tell you that if you like reseller content, to be sure to um, subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit the like if you're enjoying this video. But uh, my channel is all about reseller content. That's what I do is a little my part-time hustle. It's a business that I've started and I'm really trying to grow it. Um, so, and I'm, and I'm feeling good about it. Um, this is an extra large pure Jill, which is um, their like organic-y line. Uh, $2.48. It's just a little tank, like a blue tie-dye tank tunic type top with this little pull string right there. And I'm sure this can be machine washed. I'm not even going to look. We'll just put that right there. You know what? I bet it wants to be washed on cold because of the tie-dye. So we'll wash it with the cold stuff. Let's see. Oh, this is pretty. What is this? All right. This is a new to me brand. Eva Franco. So go down in the comments if you have any experience with this brand, because this is new to me. So I did run comps on this and it has been a hot minute. So I don't remember what they were like, but they must have been good enough for me to give it a try. It's this great tweed um, career piece. It really pretty. It is missing and that needs to be snipped off right there, but it is missing its belt. Um, and honestly, I don't know if I'll leave that on there. I might just leave the belt loops and say no belt included. Um, but it is a size six and it was $5.98. Knee length tweed. It's like a navy blue with kind of like a coral stitch going through it. And it has pockets. And I'm pretty sure this is probably, let's see. This is probably going to go into the dry clean. Yep, dry clean. Okay, what we got here? Torrid size five. This was $2.48. And it is a tunic top with that pretty white embroidery down the center. It is navy blue, and I'm sure that can go into the cold. Let's see what we got here. I think this is another Torrid. Torrid size four, $2.48. Another little summer top, same kind of cut. And this is like a pink floral with a little lace trim. We'll put that in the 
blue, with the lighter colors. Okay, we already looked at those, that bag of shoes. Whoa, was this more shoes? It didn't want to move. More shoes, okay. Let's see, we got Gianni Beanie. Look how cute those are. Look at that, how adorable are those? Those are just too cute. Look how cute. Like a wedge platform and like no wear, look. Very little wear, very little. $4.98. Those are adorable. Okay, those are a keeper. Those are a keeper. Okay, what do we got here? This is Kate Spade Saturday, which I'm not familiar with, but it's a little booty, size eight. Paid $5.98 for it. It doesn't have very much wear, but it does have sticky on the bottom. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot. I noticed after I bought these. So the outside doesn't look bad at all. Like, seriously, like, not bad at all. And that feels like it's suede. I wonder if they're a size 8. But the inside is rough. Like, it's really rough. Like, somebody really, I don't know if they just weren't made that good or somebody, like, because they look like they were worn, like, once. Like, there's not, they're not scuffed or anything. Like, look at this. I don't know what happened there. Or if maybe they were like left in the heat or something and that like plasticky stuff on the inside just didn't hold up because I feel like the outside is leather. Um, I might have to do some Google imaging um, because I don't, because that black is all damaged. All I can see is I can see that they are a size eight, but I don't see anything else but I'm fairly confident that that is leather and that is suede um, and the outside looks great. So, um, yeah. And they're a brown, but they actually have like almost like a warm undertone to them. I'm not sure how to describe that, how I want to describe that. Okay, these are Anne Klein. Look at this pretty shoe. That's fun, isn't it? Um, again, like zero wear. Um, these were $4.98, size nine and a half. So that's the shoes in that bag. Let's see, we got, I think we got one more big bag sitting over on this side of me. So we'll go through this bag and then we will call this video over and I will move on to recording the next one. <laughs> All right, this is a good find. This is a good find. So I don't find this brand. This is St. John Sport by Marie Gray. Okay, so that's the, the St. John. And this is their sport line. I don't find St. John. I don't live in a place where people, well, I mean, I guess there must be someone apparently, but this is not something I come across. It is their sport line, but still I'm really excited about this. Um, the th it's a size medium. I don't think the thrift realized what, that, what they had because they had to mark it at $7.98, which is not bad for a coat or jacket. Because this is not exactly a blazer, this is more of a jacket. Um, it is a zipper front. Check out this cool pull, isn't that pretty? Um, and it's, it's not, it has all this embroidery and everything all over it. There's the front and there is the back. It has pockets, it is not suede but it feels and looks like suede, and, but it is actually polyester um, and dry clean only. So we will turn this baby inside out and put it into our dry clean. Do, 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 do. I'm so glad to be recording again. Um, so I hope this goes really well. Um, we shall see. I also have some potentially exciting news coming up. Maybe I'll talk about it in my next video. I think I will. I think I'll talk about it. I don't have a lot of details, um, but it is, once I got the details, I'm going to be pretty excited to tell you guys about it. Um, okay, so this is really a really cool piece. Never heard of this brand, Sienna Studio. So this is a new to me brand. If you are familiar with this brand, have experience with it, please give me a comment about um, what, how you do with this brand. This was $4.98 and it is a laser cut jacket, um, but what's with a hoodie, but what's even more amazing about this piece is it is suede leather. This whole thing is suede leather, and I will find you the tag to prove it. 
100% suede leather. Isn't that cool? G3 Apparel. I don't know what that means. I'm going to have to look that up because there's a little tag that says G3 Apparel. But anyways, um, yeah, this is a suede leather hoodie. And I hope you can see that laser cutout. All laser cutout all over it. So that's really cool. Um, that's not going to go in the wash at all. I don't know <laughs> what I'm really going to do. What does it say? Leather cleaner or something? Care hand wash cold how do you how are they doing leather hand wash cold separately turn the garment inside out use mark mild soap not detergent do not bleach dry flat do not hang dry iron or re on reverse side warm iron if needed use cotton cloth over garment to iron so they're saying you can wash this in cold Huh, like I'm gonna show you guys so you realize, so you know I'm not like just making this up. Look, so yeah, it's like saying that you can wash this leather. Huh, I think I'm gonna put it in its own little separate bag so I can kind of go back and look at it again. Maybe I'll, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. We shall see. What do we got here? Okay, another career piece. This is an also a new to me brand, Le Chateau, Le Chateau, Le, Le, Le Chateau. Um, again, comment, um, let me know if you have experience with this brand. Uh, looks like it was $5.98, it is a size small. And I really liked the hardware on this. I really liked this right here. Um, it is a um, sheath uh, knee length dress. It is missing the belt, but that is a that would take like a really nice big size chunky belt. But I mean, I think that the girl that's going to um, or the woman that's going to get this dress is going to have like a killer belt to put with it. Um, so yeah, I'm not too worried about the belt. I might style it with something if I have something to style it with. Um, this is made out of let's see. This is oh linen linen rayon spandex. Okay, okay. So we're dry clean only. So it's going to go in my little dry clean basket right here in front of me. Didn't realize it was linen. Okay, we've got another career piece. Uh, this is Tahari ASL, which is their Tahari's higher end line. It doesn't, I mean, it's not like, you know, crazy expensive as far as retail or resale. Retail, this dress was probably. 150 bucks or so, maybe a little bit more, size six. It was $5.98. Really pretty blue with that little peplum around it. And it is like a knee length uh, career piece. Let's see. Um, ASL, I mean, this will probably sell in like the, hopefully in the 30 to $35 range. Uh, poly spandex dry clean. Let's see, ooh, this is pretty. Okay, this is a crochet maxi dress by, let's see who this is by, I don't recall. London Times, size 14. So I really got this not based on brand, but based on style, because it is a beautiful navy blue. Here's like kind of the top, so it's got this off shoulder, um, or maybe it goes on shoulder, I'm not sure. And then this around the neck, all this blue crochet, it's all navy blue, and it is a full maxi dress. So it's actually quite long. I'm 5'9". It is very much on the floor. Um, but here's the beautiful crochet. And it's kind of showing black on screen, but it is navy blue. So isn't that pretty? All the way down to the floor. It is lined. Let's see how it wants to be cleaned. Let's ask it. Has a zipper in the back. $5.98 is what they asked for it. So um, at that price range, I would like, I'm going to guess this is going to be a dry clean, but it might be washable. Um, let's see. Since it's poly, I think I said poly polyester or no, that was the last piece. Oh, here we go. Here's our tag. Um, but it is also polyester. Turn inside out, place garment in mesh bag, machine wash cold. Okay, so we'll just go ahead and turn her inside out. And we'll put her over in the cold basket. 
I don't think I'll actually put her in anything because I'm washing in my delicate cycle. So, um, okay, look at here. So this is a, so this I think did not, I think someone has removed the actual tag up here, but that's okay because I found this tag right there. So that is Diane Von Fergusberg, well, however you say her name. Um, this is a viscose and poly blend and we are going to dry clean this baby um they've got her marked on this thing as a small five dollars and 98 cents um but and, I, and she may very well be a small um she's a little mini dress with the eyelet lace um very pretty very boho white a little bit different for diane von fergusberg i feel like because i feel like she tends to do more or at least my experience with finding her stuff has been a little bit more tailored than that. And that's definitely like a boho look. What we got here, another career piece. This is Tahari ASL, size six, $5.98. I believe the other one was a size six also, so it might be the same person. Really pretty little sheath career piece. And if you'll look closely at that fabric, it's kind of um, woven almost. I'm not sure how to describe that, but I do, I also like this interesting chest, how it like crisscrosses. It's really pretty. I'm gonna guess this is um, dry clean, but we'll double check. We will double check. She is Rayon and Polly, and she is do 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 dry clean. Okay. Two more pieces for this video. We having fun yet? I've missed you guys. Okay, another career piece. Adriana Papel, size six. Like this might all be the same person. Adriana Papel, size six, $4.98. This is like a hunter green. They're very similar silhouettes, these, these dresses, and I think they're all the same size. Um, sheath dress, also missing its belt. This is more of like a stretch, where the others have been a little bit more, like not tailored, but tighter fit. Um, this has spandex in it, poly rayon spandex, and it says remove belt before dry cleaning. We don't have a belt, so we put it right there. Okay, last piece for this video, and this is going to be Bowden. This is size 8 petite for $5.98, and there's the Bowden tag. And this is like a nautical um, mini dress. Navy blue with this high neck, this pretty white accent buttons. And it's just a navy blue mini dress. Kind of in like that knit t-shirt material um, with pockets. Let's see, it's lined. And it is cotton, uh, modal, and elastane. The lining is poly. And how do you wanna be washed? You wanna be washed delicate ma machine wash. So we'll put it over in the cold delicate. Alrighty, that is all for this video. I thank you so much for sticking with me and I appreciate you coming by. Um, again, if you have not seen my channel before, I am Heather with Hot Posh Fashions. I am on Poshmark, eBay, and Mercari, and I'm so glad to be back with you. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and be sure to like this one. I will see you in the next one. Bye.